And uh, if you can talk with your daughter and say, make clear to her, you know, I'm always here, and you've got nothing to worry about, and you're going to have a wonderful marriage yourself, you know, uh, please God. But um, I know fathers who have sat across from their daughters about that age, 10, 11, 12. And by the way, if nobody's telling you this, adolescence starts at 11 these days, especially for parents. Uh, but if you look at her in the eye, and when you're talking with your daughter, you have to make eye contact with her. Because girls respond very, very well to eye contact. And make, make sure she sees in your eyes that she's the center of your universe. And you can tell her, I want you to understand, you know, you're a very beautiful, attractive young lady. That's the way God has made you. And you can learn from, you know, the difficulties our family has been through. And that I will... Uh, uh, a lot of young men are going to be very, very interested in you. But you know, all men at the same speech are a very sharp into predators or protectors. And uh, you know, some predators want to pornography, they want to use women, they, and they trick, they are materialistic people, which means that they treat people like things. You know, it doesn't just mean that you pursue things yourself. And uh, those men have to come out of your life. And the protectors are the ones who were strong, and good, as I try to be. So, as much as possible, I need to approve of every guy that you're going with you know, in the future. Any guy who takes you out, any guy who's being serious. I want to meet him, I want to sit down, I want to chat with him. 